Hi everyone, welcome back. Today I'm taking a look at the Thermal Master P2 Pro, a tiny thermal camera that attaches right to your smartphone. It's advertised as the smallest thermal camera in the world. It weighs just nine grams, but don't let the size fool you. It's packed with some impressive features and we'll compare it to the Fleur 1 to see how it stacks up. First off, the P2 Pro is seriously compact. You can throw it into your pocket or bag and forget that it's there until you need it. But what really stands out is just how easy it is to use. You just plug it into your phone and it's powered directly from your phone. No extra batteries to charge, which I love. I can't count the amount of times that I've gone to use the Fleur 1 and realized that it wasn't charged. With the P2 Pro, as long as your phone's got power, you're good to go. It also powers on really quickly. You just plug it in, open the app, and you're ready to scan within seconds. That's a big deal if you're in a rush or you just want to check something really, really quickly. With the Flow One, once you've connected, you need to wait for it to start up, and that always felt a bit slow to me. Now let's talk about how this little camera works for homeowners because that's where I think that it really shines. One of the best things I've found is for checking underfloor heating and radiators. With radiators, it's brilliant for spotting cold spots Spots, which means you could have a blockage, trap air, or sludge buildup. You can also use it to compare radiator temperatures in different rooms, which is a simple way to see how heat is being distributed across your entire system. If you've got underfloor heating, it's a fantastic way of visualizing heating patterns, and you can see if the pipes are warming up evenly, and if there are areas that are not performing as well as they should be. The P2 Pro has some great features for making these checks even easier. For example, you can tap the screen to monitor up to three points at the same time. That's something that you couldn't do with the Fleur one and I found that to be very very helpful and then you can even track multiple readings and check the heat output at different points on your underfloor heating as an example. There's also a feature where you can draw a line to monitor the temperature along something like a pipe or a section of underfloor heating. It gives you the average reading which makes it perfect for getting a sense of how consistent the heat output is and if you want to monitor an area you can draw a box or a circle to get an average temperature for that zone. It's a really clever way to get more precise data. One of my favorite features of the Thermal Master P2 Pro is the picture-in-picture -picture mode. This lets you overlay the thermal image directly onto your phone's standard camera view so you can see exactly where the hot or cold spots are in the real world. It's incredibly useful for tasks like finding drafts around doors or windows or pinpointing insulation gaps and walls. Instead of trying to match a standalone thermal image to a physical area, Picture-in-Picture -picture gives you a clear combined view that makes identifying problem areas faster and a lot easier. Image quality is another area where the P2 Pro really shines. The thermograms it produces are sharper and more detailed than the Fleur one. That extra clarity makes it so much easier to spot subtle temperature differences like heat escaping through poorly insulated walls or gaps around doors and windows. Now let's talk about temperature range. The P2 Pro can measure up to 600 degrees centigrade, which is way beyond what the Fleur One could do. For most homeowners, you're probably not hitting those extremes, but if you're checking things like stoves, boilers, or other high temperature appliances, that extra range gives you a lot more flexibility. All in all, the P2 Pro is just more convenient. It's smaller, lighter, and powered directly by your phone, so you don't have to worry about charging it separately. It's faster to get going, and it offers far better image quality and more features for analyzing heat distribution and temperature differences. So whether you're tracking down drafts, checking your radiators, or inspecting underfloor heating, the P2 Pro makes it really easy to do. I think it's a fantastic tool for homeowners who want to improve energy efficiency or troubleshoot heating issues. If you're interested in picking up the Thermal Master P2 Pro, you can use the coupon code RHHP2Pro at checkout to get the discount. The code and the link are in the description below, so be sure to check that out. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments below, and if you found this video helpful, please give us a thumbs up and subscribe. See you in our next video, bye bye.